Hi, Roy Williams with Airframe Components, and today our topic is Piper Service Bolton 1216 regarding the inspection of the outboard hinge bracket on PA32301 Saratoga Ailer. To accomplish this inspection, Piper has you removing the outboard hinge bracket and doing a die penetrant check of the rib. As you can see, this particular nose rib with the hinge bracket removed has a crack immediately underneath the lower bolt hole. Once the leading edge skin has been removed from the aileron and the rib has been removed from the aileron structure, it can be replaced with a new rib from Piper Aircraft. In Service Bolton 1216, Piper states that the nose rib should not have nut plates installed, that it should be installed with a bolt and a nut. This brand new nose rib that I have from Piper has nut plates installed on it, which makes the service bulletin ineffective at this point. Our preferred method on correcting this is to simply remove the nut plates, reverse the bolt from the inside, putting the nut on the outside with torque lock on it so that anybody looking into uh, the hinge area for further inspections can immediately verify that there are no nut plates installed on this new nose rib. Once the new nose rib is installed on the aileron structure, the outboard leading edge can then be replaced onto the aileron. This is a good opportunity to inspect the two screws that attach the counterbalance weight to the leading edge skin at the outboard portion of the aileron, checking for cracks along those screw lines. As you can see here, this particular outboard leading edge skin has cracks around both attaching screws.